one two four McLaren in Ferrari's race. P3 for George Russell, very, very, very close qualifying. So let's jump into the video. Hi everyone, I'm Minge, and today we're gonna discuss about the 2024 Italian Grand Prix qualifying. We're gonna start with this image that is Monza, one of the oldest Formula One track i will go to monza tomorrow we'll do a great great video so subscribe to the channel so yeah the start of q1 very big snap almost ended in the world carl signs with his ferrari also piastri went wide in turn one and this year is very different they changed all the track and for example these last year we had sausage that was not really a curve but the sausage banana i don't know how to how to say that but now we have grass that slow you down and you can't go 100% throttle when you're on the track this is george russell was really really fast mercedes to be honest in free practice not really in q1 this is franco colapinto in q1 and safer release there very big and safe release from piastri to max verstappen this is the q1 classification we have norris leclerc Piastri signs, Russell Verstappen, Hamilton, Albon, Perez, Lukanberg, Magnus, and Ricardo. They qualified. The eliminated were Sunoda for 44 milliseconds behind. A team Daniel Ricardo, then Stroll, Colapinto, Bottas, and Guanyu Joe. A big snap also for, for Magnus, and at, in particular at the Parabolica. He almost ended up like Antonelli, but he did. And this is Franco Colapinto as well. Did a very big snap in Q1. Unfortunately, eliminated P17, as I said, I think. Yep, no, sorry, P18 in his first Formula 1 qualifying. Mm, yeah, this is what, what I said to you. Kevin Magnussen in Parabolica. So, yeah, the eliminated we already said. This is the moment where Daniel Ricciardo crossed the finish line to be in Q2. Q2 is here with Carlos Sainz, Charles Leclerc, London Norris, London Norris that... Yeah, the McLaren was really flying, is the car to beat, and we know this from Netherlands, but from a lot of races, to be honest. From Miami is close, and I think from, from Hungary, maybe also Silverstone is the car to beat. Yeah, we have the Ferrari, we have Charles Leclerc here, that did a good job, not a really good lap in, in Q2, but in Q3 and Q1, the, the nice lap. Hamilton here, you know, not a lot to say about the Q2, they were so, so, so close. Fernando Alonso P11 and in the, for 10 milliseconds eliminated by Nico Hülkenberg and in the interview, no sorry not in the interview but in the team radio he said P11 is better than we expected probably, his teammate is P17 so very clear, very very hard Fernando in, in the radio, this is Q2 classification, the eliminated as I said Alonso, Ricardo, Magnussen, Gasly and Esteban Ocon, Leclerc P7, not a really great lap, lap for him. O overall, then Max left off when he was doing the best lap, probably. We don't really know why, but okay, we can jump in Q3. The, the tension where <laughs> was so high, to be honest. Obviously, I'm hoping, I was hoping for, for Leclerc, for the Ferrari. Anyway, this is an unsafe release from Sainz, not as hard as the P for release, but it was an unsafe release, probably no penalty. Because, as we saw in the past, all the team needs to pay in terms of euros, but not penalties in terms of really greed sport penalties. So this is London Norris, fastest lap for him. In the first run of Q3, there was Norris, Sainz Leclerc, Perez, I don't first, and then Halkenberg. So a very big snap here for, for Max Verstappen, and that's why he's behind. It was behind his teammate, I don't know why I have these pictures. So at the end, it was pole position for Lando Norris that will start in P1 tomorrow. P2 for his teammate Oscar Petri for an amazing George at the end. Beated the Ferraris. This is the final classification. Norris Piastri, Russell Leclerc, Sainz Hamilton, Verstappen Paris, Albon and Nicole Kumberg in Q3, both in Q3. Albon and Berg, better lap of Leclerc that beat it is teammate by 3 milliseconds I think, something like that or 6 milliseconds, I'm not sure, then Leclerc also 21 milliseconds behind George Russell so it was really really close, also with, with Oscar Piastri not a lot, like 30 milliseconds, so it was really Norris that did a big difference because from the second to the sixth less than one tenth of gap. So yeah, very, very, very close. I can't wait to see the race tomorrow because I will be there in Monza, exit of Ascari. So if you will be there, 
I will be there all day, I will be in fun zone, I will do the track walk after the race, will be a big, big, a big video on this channel. So yeah, my top two drivers of today are P3, P2, P1, Norris, because yeah, Wilkenberg did a very good job with us in to be in P10, Alban also in P9, in Q3, and also Norris did a big difference on his teammates, so... Well done to him, he will start on pole, hopefully for him, he will not do a bad start as we as he always do, <laughs> sorry about it, yes, so, for this video was all, please smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, and as always, it's been a pleasure, cheers!